Hello everyone, did I give you a scare? <laughs> anyway, oh, as you know, it's getting to the time of Halloween and you may be thinking to yourself, hey Adam, I'm under 18, is there any horror games I can play? Well today, like last year, but not talking about Western Evil stuff, here are the top 5 horror games for under 18s. Here's the intro. <laughs> Five, Little Nightmares. Little Nightmares, from what I know, is a game that's also getting more DLC, it is, as sort of more stuff to attribute to the story. Now, I don't know much about it. It sounds messed up, the, the whole story it does. It sounds weird. Now, Little Nightmares, um, from what I know, is on PlayStation 4, Xbox One, Switch, and I also think PC also. Uh, the age of the game is 16, it is. Um, but I've heard a lot of good uh, stuff about it. Um, have I ever played it? Will I ever play it? No, because games like that, I don't know, maybe I like to keep away from. Number four, Stranger Things, the VR experience. Now, you do get more of an experience if you actually have a PlayStation VR. I can't remember if it's on any other thing, but as you know, uh, this also is a video on YouTube, which I'll leave a link down below. It's downloadable for free if you've got a PlayStation VR. And this is a little short section it is from when Will goes missing. This is from season one. And you should also know that Telltale is developing a game on this, hoping it gets released near season three, because I feel like a Strange Things Telltale game would be good. But apart from that, this is what I'll give you. Uh, the end of the game is actually they've wasted uh, Peggy free. Funny. Number three, Western Evil Revelations. Now I understand I talked about this before I have, um, but I want to reiterate on some stuff because things have changed. Now the game is still 16. It is. It's on other platforms now, such as the um, Switch. You can also buy on PlayStation 4, Xbox One, PlayStation 3, all of those lovely consoles. Now if you don't know the story, you're basically this is after a big town got. It's just messed up basically after a big town got messed up by some terrorists and then the government had to respond with somewhere they did, they ended up defeating them but some loose ends came undone and yeah. I am midway through it, in fact uh, when I do the games, when, I, uh, <laughs> when I'm uploading them on Addy's games, um, I will be able to complete some of the levels but I think the final boss from what I remember from last year that was a bit hard, so we'll see how this goes. But anyway, this game is weighted Peggy 16. Turn here. Straight into the depths of hell. Time. Number two, Baldi's Basics in Education and Learning. Now, by the time this is this video's um, been out, things definitely would have changed. Um, from what I know, the mobile version is set to come by the actual guy who created the game, but. Baldi's Basics also had field trips and is having so much more due to the, the success of the Kickstarter. Now I understand that you think this is not a horror game, where well, he says that it's an educational horror game. And I can also basically also say that uh, the Unwill one improves this. So I'll put both of those links down below, but yeah. <laughs> Problem 
problem, 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 problem. You're doing fantastic. You did great. Gotta sweep, sweep, sweep. Number one, Silent Hill 2. Now, I've heard a lot about the Silent Hill franchise, how it's kind of died off entirely. Now, Silent Hill uh, 2, um, from when it was first released, it was age 15, but I'm guessing that would have been changed to 16, but you are still able to buy this game to this day. I know there are other versions of Silent Hill, but not all of them are weighted um, a 15 or 16, most of them now are weighted 18 due to the high violence and the gore and and everything that's basically in it. Uh, the concept of these games sounds okay, but the whole story of it, every time I every time I watch videos about it, it's always messed up. So fucking messed up. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Hopefully there will be more lip top list videos coming um, soon within the time of this Halloween stuff. Anyway, I'll, I'll see you on the next one. Peace guys, see ya, and happy Halloween.